felt like he helped that top player get better, even though uh, he's not a top player himself. It's it's because of like you see a lot more unorthodox options chosen because oh, yeah. like they're like everybody is more more encouraged to kind of like play to their own personal style and sometimes you'll be like oh wow I didn't know like up B in that situation can totally work but anyway Otis going in with his Mario up against Splorch with Cloud this is a matchup that I remember seeing a bunch in uh, Smash Four and I oh, think yeah. a lot of the fundamentals still kind of hold together the sword does keep Mario at bay but when he breaks in he deals so much damage another threat of flood once Cloud is off stage can lead to some really devastating edge guards especially if he doesn't have limit ready to go. Yeah, Cloud still being a very solid character in this game. Uh, <laughs> all right. Solid 95% yeah. for a single opening by Otis. Otis is tackling a lot of damage. And then right there, you knew Splorch had to get rid of that that uh, cross slash because you can't keep limit forever in this game. Yeah, it's a, it's always scary too, though, because like the moment you then spend it, it's like, okay, then if I get knocked off stage, I'm going to be very exploitable because I'm going to yeah. be near the blast zone in that situation. Okay, up special out of shield being a really good option for Cloud in this game. Especially on a stage like Smashville where then you land immediately on the platform. It makes it a little bit harder to punish with something meaty. All right. We've got Mario making it back onto the stage. Gets Cloud off stage exactly where he doesn't want to be, but he was able Ooh. to get the limit. That's it didn't matter. Air dodge, yeah. Oh, Woo! barely, barely being able to snap back on, but that's so good for Scorch. Yeah. He's in a position to be able to take this first stock off of Otis. Uh, he can make it back on time. Oh, Ooh, that's actually... Finish jump, and then... Oh, perfect. but he's... Cape. No, okay, he's yeah. not going to make it. I was like, how good is Cloud's <laughs> drift? <laughs> I've, I've seen Clouds in the sky, man. They'd be gone. <laughs> that All was right. really fortunate for him that he got hit by the flood right out of the air dodge so that the uh, falling that he went down didn't actually yeah. change his chances of coming back. Okay. Otis now watching the ledge. And just going to pick up that shield grab. And there's nothing wrong with that, even though it kind of feels bad that you're not killing immediately. Yeah. You're, you're just showing your opponent you can't keep just walking up and shielding. And then sooner or later, you know, get a back air, get a forward tilt, and you can walk away with it. And this is a good call by Otis, right? He sees he starts with, oh, with limit. Yeah, and yeah. he's just like, you have to spend it instantly. You're not going to get that much value off of it. Wow, but then he just came over, cross slashed him, then did uncharged cross slash. All right, both of you guys making it back onto the stage. Beautiful, yep, getting that reverse hit. That's having to read whether or not uh, Otis was going to cross him up, but Splurge got it. Yeah. Ooh. Back here, just barely missing with the fair. Gets Cloud offstage once again. We have Limit. Mario at 70 damage. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Ooh. Otis blocks it. The moment Otis sees that the, uh, the Limit's up, like we see him not throw out any buttons in neutral. Yeah. And I think that's one of those times where Splurge should be able to start picking up on that and getting some grabs, tossing them off stage. Mm -hmm. It's ultimately fighting games are about taking what your opponent gives you. You don't yeah. really get to choose how you win interactions unless you way, way outclass your opponent. Okay, we got up special out of shield. Mm -hmm. Once again, calling out that uh, Otis is going for a cross up. Splorch owning the stage now, 154%, and once again, limit ready to go. Got, got one more grab. Up throw. Limit's about to go out, too, if yeah. my count is right. So Splurge probably going to be looking to spend it somehow. Woo! Oh, Beautiful. my gosh. And Otis was so afraid. He was like, Cloud's back here. That thing is still oppressive. And I love how, like, Splurge handled that, too, right? He didn't commit on a dash attack like he did previously because he knew Otis knew to get off the ledge before he ran out of invincibility. Yeah. So instead, held his ground with a couple of back airs. All right, tossed him off stage. We got the flood. Uh, I think he <laughs> might have used his jump. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> You got, you got to hold on to that thing until you know Mario's out of water, man. It's Yeah, it's a really tough time when you're a character uh, with a short up B like that. All right, Mario making it back to the ledge. He's going to get back aired off stage once again. Oh, he needs to try to find a way to get center stage here. It's so tricky, especially on Smashville, because this is a stage where the main neutral zone is that tiny patch of land yeah. under the platform. Because otherwise, you're landing with your back to the corner or you're landing right above your opponent and they can start sharking you. Ooh. Tries to come up with the aggressive option. Ooh. Ooh with the forward tilt. Yeah, Not good. Not yet going to kill. It was a good reaction, though, to the uh, up even missing the ledge snap. All right, that's, that second one's going to kill, but we get no animation that time. He said, you know what? Everybody gets one. <laughs> and that, that was one thing that Splash was doing a lot against Otis, was constantly calling out the roll get up. Yep. Uh, Otis was feeling, understandably, very nervous on the ledge when you're up against Cloud. We all have memories of that back air being so True. oppressive. Uh, especially when you're at a really high percent, I know in Smashville, the thought of I'm going to call out back air by parrying it so I can get like a proper punish is terrifying because it's this really small side blast zone. If you guess wrong, you're actually just exploding. 
So I'm guessing that Otis might opt for a stage with larger side blasts. No, never mind, going straight to Yoshi's. Huh. So wait, this wait, which which Yoshi? Single or try? Yoshi's Yoshi's Island. So this is oh, a similar okay. size uh, side blast yeah, as this match. He said he needs a longer platform actually. And yeah, this is this is a very similar layout. The main difference is the the tilts in the base platform. So I'm kind of curious what exactly Otis has up his sleeve here. Okay, we're along to game number two. You got Splorch taking that one in, in a pretty nice fashion. I feel like as the match went on, uh, he started to understand things. Mm -hmm. uh, definitely versus Mario. He's gonna have to watch that jump off stage if he plans on taking this 2-0. Yeah. Oof. Otis, yeah, just backing off immediately after he's in with the guaranteed damage. He's showing a lot more respect, especially because the, the threat of Climb Hazard is coming out and breaking his combos. All right, we have some footsies here. Up air, up air. Cloud still has that move. Ooh, okay. Got an air. Going for a roll get up at like that early of a percent, I think it actually caught Splorge off guard. But Splorge, oh, that still doesn't take it. Otis is going to be able to snap on. Rolls right under the back air. Yeah. Otis getting hit by the blade beam there. Uh, yeah, that's actually something that I completely forgot about. But yeah. because the slant goes down, this actually helps Cloud's edge guarding a lot because it covers a much more awkward angle. You're forced to go high to avoid that, and then Cloud can, you know, bait that out and then hit you with the back air instead. Woo! And the down smash is gonna kill. Yeah, that uh, that blade beam on the ground is definitely a very memey move. <laughs> <laughs> I've been known to get clobbered by that every once in a while. All right, we got Cloud making it back onto the platform. Mm -hmm. Ooh, the up airs. That platform is definitely not somewhere you want to be against Cloud. Yeah, I think Cloud's going to benefit way more thanks to Like, up air isn't as oppressive as it used to be, but it's still a really good just short hop move. And once again, just like we saw in the previous game, it's going to help his climb hazard too. Ooh, back that, air, that was very worth. Yeah, absolutely. Only 27% difference, and as Mario, if you get the right grab opening, you can more than make that up. Oh yeah, that's one grab. Okay. Ooh, okay, but Cloud getting the grab here. Yeah, Otis kind of hesitating before jumping up and up air, and you have to immediately go for the punish when you see the climb hazard come out in these situations. Because he's gonna land like in half the time that he normally does. Ooh, fair into cross slash. That's some good damage. Mario sitting at 95. Need to be careful with this with this limit. Cloud. Ooh, up special. Lord's gonna make it back to the stage. Oh. He's gonna let the cross flash rip, and he dies. Yeah, just calling out once again. Otis rushing back on stage when he's on the ledge. He usually has been trying to jump over or roll back in. So a cross flash right at that distance is really nice by Splurge. Okay, up smash a lot of shield once again. Great up smash though to punish it. Back here is gonna toss Cloud off of the stage into the get up attack. Get up attacks, uh, very. Weird move, especially on stages like this with the slants. Yeah, it can actually mess with a lot of characters uh, attacking hitboxes. It just goes up at an angle, and some people can just like low profile it a lot easier. Back here, gets Cloud off stage once again. Cross slash, aggressive option to make his way back onto the stage. Smart thinking from Splurge. I actually kind of like the way uh, Otis is handling the approaches, because Splurge is understandably really scared of getting grabbed. So whenever Otis closes the gap, Splurge has been spot dodging. Uh, and instead, Otis rarely is going for grabs. He's just like tossing out a very active hitbox to catch the spot dodge instead. Right now, we need Otis to try and find himself a kill move if he wants to woo, stay in this game. We got Cross Slash from Cloud. Or, well, let's not call it out. We got Limit from Cloud. Yeah. And Whoa. just gonna go ahead <laughs> yeah, and use you know it what? as a reversal, you, you know? know? Don't ever doubt yourself, you know? Go with your gut. You know we got a cross slash and cloud. In, in fighting games, that's like, you you get hit by a combo and you start mashing super. Because yeah. in case they drop, it's like, I got an invincible startup, I'm gonna just kill him. <laughs> <laughs>